Hello beauties, welcome back to my channel. My name is Shweta Vijay and today we are going to be talking about May favorites. I know I did not do an April favorites and I have explained it all in my last video where I did an accumulated products that I hate from the month of Jan all the way till April. Okay, and I thought of doing that once, basically quarterly, I want to do such a video so that just like how I'm telling you things that I loved, uh, they're also things that have gone into my hate list. So please check out that video and I've explained why I didn't do my April favorites there, not getting into it. Now, usually I'm not this dramatic with my eye makeup. You guys know that I love my simple fresh glam. This is for another video where I'm testing out a lot of new makeup that is available in India. Well, at least new to me. Uh, so stay tuned for that video. And what I want to tell you before diving into the list right now is please subscribe to my channel. It's only going to help my channel grow. 40% of you are still watching my video without hitting that red button, that simple subscribe button that can just help my channel get stronger. Because if you really want to know genuine, genuine feedback about certain things, you know that you can rely on my channel every now and then. So please do the sister a favor and just do the needful. Let's dive in. So the first thing that I want to include is this Instagram account called The Art Box by Shivani. Okay, so they make customized jewelry boxes, customized makeup holders, uh, makeup brush holders, you know, basically for your vanity, just to make it look really nice and lovely. They customize it for you and they uh, deliver at your doorstep. And they are beautifully made, you guys. You know, Shivani, uh, it's a woman-owned brand. You guys know I've been supporting a lot of women-owned brand and she contacted me and she told me about her, her brand. So she made this jewelry box with one of my favorite pictures of Nirvana and me uh, while we had you know taken a small staycation and that's my all-time favorite picture and she just customized that and she made this lovely jewelry box you guys and as you can see there's other brush holders also that she makes and anything that you require she will make that for you and the best part about it is the quality of it it's so well made it's so sturdy and it looks so nice on your vanity so you can choose the patterns you can choose the color so if you are someone who's looking out to just you know perk up your vanity your makeup room or in general you're looking out for something that's of really good quality art box by Shivani it is okay everything is linked down in the information bar do check it out I had to give a shout out to this because it is that good all right so now let's move on to the next one this is the earth collective hair color shampoo now I have spoken about my best products from the Earth Collective. I've got five favorites and if you have missed it then I'm also going to link my Instagram account right below in the information bar. It'll take you straight to that video. If you want me to speak a lot more about the Earth Collective let me know. Now Earth Collective is this hair care brand that specializes only on hair care. They don't deviate onto anything else but they target your specific hair needs. So if you have a certain requirement, your scalp condition is not healthy, your hair is looking really dull, you're looking out for shampoo, conditioner, whatever that is going to give your hair some life and shine, the Earth Collective it is. Now this one, this is the hair colored shampoo and conditioner, is just simply perfect. My hair feels so nice and so shiny um, and I color my hair a lot because 70% of my hair is gray. I have to color it every 10 days. And yeah, it's a little drastic. And also you need products, shampoo and conditioner, that is not going to make your hair color run. And because I've got stubborn grays, uh, color doesn't stick onto my hair strands as well as it should. So I need something that is going to make it sustain a little bit longer. And the Earth Collective Shampoo and Conditioner does that for me. Not only does it nourish my hair strands and, you know, it's making my scalp a little more healthier, it gives that shine and that bounce and that volume. Uh, I have noticed every time I apply this hair conditioner and the shampoo as well, it protects the hair color and it gives some life to it. Wonderful brand that you have to pay attention to. I think I have a discount code. I'm not sure, but if I do, this is it. Okay, so now let's move on to the next one. The next one is the Oat Cleansing Balm from the Inky List, and it's a beautiful cleansing balm. Now, I discovered this late 2020, and I had a small sample of it, and my skin thoroughly enjoyed it. It's a little thick. You have to warm it up between your fingers, and you have to apply it. It didn't clog my pores, and it's extremely gentle. It's perfect for all skin types, including oily, acne-prone skin, because that's what I have. I have combination acne-prone skin. For dry skin, this is just perfect. 
you know when you take your time to melt away the makeup especially for double cleanse at night this is a beautiful mild ritual to follow it just deeply cleanses your makeup the grit and grime that is stuck in your pores it it does something and when you wash off with a nice mild cleanser what i've noticed is that it's not too stripping because oat anyway is filled with such good nutrients for your skin so i highly recommend the inky list for people who do not know what the inky list is they are exactly like the ordinary they give you affordable skincare that's of really good quality of course the ordinary is somewhere there but the inky list is definitely catching up and their product launches each one is better than the next and i know many instagram indian instagram stores that sell the inky list as well as you know the ordinary i shall link my favorites in the information box and if you want me to do the best of super drug the best of cult beauty best of inky list the best of ordinary let me know guys and i shall do it for you now, now let's move on to the next one and that is suganda squalane oh my god now this squalane i have done a whole separate video on the benefits of squalane who should use squalane in fact everyone can and how this is that one wonder oil that goes beautifully with actives i in this video you need to follow my oil series you guys because i know that when i'm educating you about a certain oil profile it is basically for you to make an informed decision on what oil to choose for your skin type okay and then it is through trials and errors you're going to understand whether that is good for you or not so don't take it as a bible it's basically just a breakdown of what each oil does for you and the same thing i've done with squalane even there i've explained the difference between squalane and squalane because a lot of people still get confused and call it squalane there are very few good squalanes in the indian market and suganda squalane is extremely light um it's very very hydrating it's that perfect oil to apply even in the morning okay it's not too heavy so if you want to apply this before your makeup if you want to mix it with your foundation for that extra hydration this is the kind of squalane that you can reach out for it is such a beautifully formulated squalane oh my god no fragrance in this it suits each and every skin type it's just a wonderful wonderful product from suganda now let's move on to the next one this is fool luxury incense cones in the scent lavender i've also got the incense stick um in rose pool fool okay a lot of people call it pool a lot of people call it fool anyway they just make sustainable sambranis <laughs> they just make sustainable incense sticks okay so whatever is left over temple flowers you know they dry it up and they make this beautiful incense sticks uh that just makes your house and your room smell so lovely i love the lavender one it's so mild and so gentle it's not nauseating and not overwhelming you know it's just that very mild fragrance and it just puts you in a very good mood and i love the packaging of it this is basically for 145 rupees you guys and the best part about this brand is that they give job opportunities to women okay so there's a lot of employment given to women um who need that job who need to survive who needs to take care of their family so every time that you support brands like this and you buy from brands like this rest assured that your money is being put to good use and i just like the aesthetics behind it i like the hard work it's all hand rolled handmade uh, sustainable even the outer packaging and in, when you open it the packaging is so nice okay this is you get this little small clay pot that you can put your cones uh, especially even incense sticks you get that incense stick holder uh, for the price you're not paying anything extra for it so even if you want to gift this to someone for example, example if i was a bride to be and if i had any event um i would gift this to people you know i would gift this to my guest all right so the next one is the earth rhythm ultra defense spf 50 now i have done the best of earth rhythm it's my latest video go check it out if you want to know my opinion on what my top 12 are if you're looking at shopping at earth rhythm because they have some killer sales going on right now and you want to pick up some really amazing stuff something that is safe and you know you can trust and you will love then please check out this video this is a hybrid so basically it's got chemical and physical filters i've explained it all in my best of okay but this one is extremely lightweight it just melts on the skin it's got a very nice water consistency so it just melts very well onto the skin without leaving a white cast they have really nailed it out here now the new research 
team that uh, Earth Rhythm has, they do a lot of clinical trials. So they also do in vivo and in vitro analysis for their products, okay? Which is extremely important because then you know if they're doing an in vivo analysis, you can trust the sunscreen. Definitely something that I have been wearing daily, okay? Now let's move on to the next one. This is the Dermaco 2% salicylic acid. I love Dermacos, salicylic acid, my God. I heard about it through various bloggers. In fact, Jovita was the one who told me about the vitamin C from Dermaco. You know that their sister brand is Mama Earth and you're always questioning the brand and this is so wrong. So that is why you really need to make your own decision. I'm telling you that salicylic acid really reduced my zits. The only problem with this salicylic acid is that it's got a very mild fragrance of almost like a oud kind of fragrance. Once it goes on the skin and after about five minutes, you won't sense it. But when you're applying it, the first five minutes, you can smell some kind of a fragrance. And Dermaco, they've got very few products that are fragrance free. And I just wish that they would go completely fragrance free. I will explain my top Dermaco definitely. I'm trying to contact the brand to see if they will work with me. This salicylic acid every time my skin needed rescuing and I had these small tiny bumps and I wanted that to disappear and I want my acne zits to disappear. This BHA has stepped up and like how beautiful BHA from uh, Dermaco. Please don't be afraid just because it's Dermaco, sister brand is Mama Earth. What I have tried guys definitely has taken me by surprise. The next one is K-Beauty Rolling Lipstick. Now, I am not a lipstick person, rest in peace, lipsticks, you know, because of the whole mask thing. But every time I feel like just being a little naughty when it comes to lipsticks, I have been reaching out for rolling from K-Beauty. First of all, K-Beauty brand, they definitely, each new launch of theirs, they're stepping up, you guys. It's better than the last. And these lipsticks are worth every penny. They are not too drying matte. They are not too creamy matte. It's just the right matte. And this rolling shade is absolutely beautiful, okay? It just... It's got that nice autumn winter vibe to it, definitely. It has got that little bit of that wampness, but there is something so classy about this color. And many times, dark colors like this, this dark grape berry colors, can get a little too patchy and streaky. It takes a very good formulated lipstick to give you that full saturated color. You know, one swipe saturated creaminess. That's what K-Beauty lipstick does. Any color that you choose, I don't think you're going to regret the purchase, but rolling is a great option, especially if you like your dark lipsticks. Let's move on to the next one, you guys, and that is Dr. Shade's Vitamin C Serum. Beautiful vitamin C. It's got amla, it's got vitamin E, ferulic acid, everything that is highly compatible with the vitamin C, this one does have it, okay? I know the first time when you apply it, it's going to be a little sticky and tacky, but your skin easily absorbs it. And the thing is, it's got a high vitamin C percentage, 20%. High percentage vitamin C is usually recommended by dermatologists. I wouldn't suggest this for a beginner who's not used to vitamin C at all. But saying that, you guys, I didn't think that I would be blown away by this 20% vitamin C, but oh boy, what a beautiful vitamin C it is. Because usually with the 10%, 5%, it takes me about a month and a half to see some radiancy on my skin. This within 15, 20 days, bam, there was, my skin saw a difference. It was, it was tight, okay? It was radiant. And the marks that I had around my mouth, I saw it being lightened, okay? This was really working its magic. So I think Dr. Sheth has done a great job. They are a family of, you know, skin doctors. So they would know exactly how to formulate a good vitamin C and they proved it with this one. So now let's move on to some easy breezy products and I'm talking about a food item. The food item that just won my heart since the time I've come here is this instant ramen noodles called from Samyo. And this is something that you can even get in Amazon India. I've seen it, but I've never tried it. It's only when I got here and Giri was like, you really need to try this. I was like, okay, let's give it a shot. So the first time he made it for me, I think I, I was crying while having it because it is super spicy. So this noodles is only meant for somebody who's got a high spice tolerance because it's a very spicy ramen. Okay, it's a nice soupy noodle and it's 
it's just so perfect you guys so for those days those lazy days that you don't want to cook and you want a little bit of that heat not a little bit a lot of it this is the one for you you know your weekend cheat days this is great okay so amazon has it sometimes they have an offer for five you get for a certain price i picked up that at the same time and i was talking to jovita about this and she i don't know if she tried this one or there was another korean spicy but she did say that to mild down the spice just cook it in milk and i was like what because who cooks ramen and noodles in milk right and i was like okay and she was like it would just mild and simmer the spice down but at the same time it will be very creamy um so you can actually do this with normal cow's milk or you can do it with coconut milk i've tried it with both and it tastes incredible she was right it just makes the noodles so creamy before serving a dash of lemon juice a little bit of coriander leaves now I'm closing it off with some light entertainment. The first thing on Netflix that I want you guys to just give it a shot is this thing called The Bold Type. I'm sure by now everyone has watched it. I have thoroughly enjoyed it. It's a proper chick flick, okay? It's that, you know, very sex in the city, young sex in the city, you know? <laughs> I just like the fashion. I like the whole friendship, the camaraderie that people share out there. A nice working atmosphere, a fantastic boss. I mean, who has boss like like that isn't it uh, if you watched it i'm sure you would agree that that's the kind of boss you really want to work for um work along with you know because she's so opinionated but at the same time strong and she's a woman's woman you know i, I like that i just like the boss a lot i think she is the heart and soul of this entire bold type and the fact that all three Sutton is beautiful i just like the it was a feel good episode feel good season okay i can't wait for the next season that's coming out um but what i liked about it though it was like this typical chick flick sex in the city type they did tackle several issues um that were important it was things that is actually happening in the society that was wonderfully tackled and that's what i liked about the show the second one that i want you to watch is this malayalam movie called nayato when it comes to Malayalam cinema, storytelling is just absolutely incredible. Three officers that are caught in something that is so unfair. I don't want to indulge into it, you guys, because then it's just giving too much of information, especially for people who haven't watched. I think there was one interview of the scriptwriter. It is kind of like taken from a real life story. So that makes this story, that makes this movie even heavier. This is definitely not your feel good movie. I can assure you that after watching it, you're going to be like... <sighs> feeling very, very heavy, especially with the thought that this could be a true story. That's entirely debatable. But the performance, the way that from the time it starts till the time it ends, you're on the edge of your seat, okay? Because it's nail biting. So yeah, guys, that ends my May favorites. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Let me know what was your favorite of the month, what skincare, what makeup. Don't forget to watch my previous video where I speak about things that you shouldn't you shouldn't buy well at least it's my opinion because just like you're doing a shopping list of hit list you should also know what's on the hate list so i shall see you very soon in my next and until later bye for now